A hero's salute to one of America's bravest golden retrievers. We're here to pay our final tribute and honor Brittany, who has served her country and her community. Brittany, the last known 9-11 search and rescue dog, was laid to rest at the old age of 16. Firefighters lined up along a Houston area sidewalk to honor the canine as she took her final steps. Brittany served our nation in so many ways, from trying to find survivors at the World Trade Center buildings to searching for victims during Hurricane Katrina. Last year, Brittany was treated by Bark Post to a day of fun in honor of her birthday from her own hotel room. To room service. Yes, you can try it. <laughs> it's really good, huh? <laughs> and a dog's Tiffany key to the city. Oh, it's so beautiful. Denise Corliss, a member of Texas Task Force One, is Brittany's owner and handler. She represents the working dogs and the disaster dogs in particular and you know they all are deserving for a day like today. After Brittany retired at the age of 10 she became a member of a local Texas fire department. She also started visiting schools where she sat with children as they read out loud in the classroom. When we deployed to some of the disasters what I didn't anticipate is the role that they take on as a therapy dog. For many, this goodbye closes a big chapter of history as first responders reflect on her heroic career. A dog deserving of so many honors gets a fitting farewell. For InsideEdition.com, I'm Lee Sheps.